And you're gonna find out on the way out if you're on the luckiest boat in the ocean. Larry took thousands and thousands of pictures on this excursion. He works on one of these cruise ships. And he loves to come out with us because it's the most phenomenal pictures that we've used tons of them in that book, okay? This is the gentleman that did that. And yeah, so Larry, it's a pleasure to have y'all aboard every time. So let's give it Larry a hand. Thanks, Larry. For helping. Thank you, Dave. Okay, welcome to Travel Guide and Photography. I'm in the wheelhouse of the Aleutian Ballad on the Bering Sea Crab Fisherman's Tour in Ketchikan, Alaska. This is one of my very, very favorite tours in all of Alaska. This is Captain Dave Lathing. Hey, Larry. He's your owner and captain here of the ship. And he's going to take you out of some places that's absolutely going to blow your mind what you're going to see. Please stay tuned all the way through the video. 25 years ago, I came to Ketchikan with my little boat called the Ballad. And that day, I was offloading halibut over here. I walked downtown, two of those cruise ships pulled up, and I'm watching hundreds of people come down those gangs. Now you know what I started thinking, huh? <laughs> this guy pulled up with a tour boat. I looked down and I said, hey, what are you doing? He says, we got 95 people coming off of these cruise ships. And I get to drive them around the bay trying to show them get you again. Look you freaking do, right? I'm a fisherman. I looked down on that water that day and I thought, there's over 50 times the amount of life in that water. How do we catch that stuff? How do we hand that stuff to you? Share it with you. Tell you our story. How do I show you things above the water? Probably going to blow your mind, isn't it? It took 10 years dreaming about it. Okay. Big D came to work for me many years ago, 30, 40, something like that. Um, I put this man through hell <laughs> on a fishing boat. Trust me. I got beat him. He'd take you put it and probably slid his wrist 10 times to get off the boat. But he's the type of guy that can stand right beside you and give you 100%. Every day, that's the type of guy you want on your boat. Big D, thank you. Thank you. Got another buddy of mine, uh, Ron Swallow. Come on out here. Ron, you guys know famous Crabber, Sig Hansen. Wow, uh, there's Keith, there's Jonathan, there's Bill Harris, you know. Ron's been at the Bering Sea for 45 years, 45. He's on vacation, you see. He just got off of a boat six months ago. He came here to get the can, and we threw a microphone on it. And we said, Ron, come out and talk to the people, right? Famous uh, guy, I think Ron's a legend in the very seat. I don't know what, Ron Paul. <laughs> and then every boat has to have the green horn, so we got a couple of them today. We got Michelle, Lila, Kendall. You guys, it's your vacation, right? If you want anything today, please ask them. These girls, they've got our backs and they have your back. So if you want something, ask them. Get out of here and let's go have a blast. There's a lot out there. You go a little ahead in the starboard. Nice Alright, here's the hook, baby. Here's the hook! Oh, we got a snarl. Snarl. We call that something different when we're not on tour. We're trying to be a little kid friendly, right? Alright, right, babe, come here a minute. Help me pull this line gun. Yeah. Pull this gently. Got it. Gently. Got it. Gently, yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, hold it by hand the whole thing. Got it. on the bottom, they're camouflaged on top, okay? When they first are born, their eyes are on both sides of their head, and then they morph onto just this side. See that? What? That's so they can see from the top. Okay. Hey, goodbye, Mr. Halliday. Let's get these guys, make sure they get a bit over here. If we kept it, we'd have to charge it for the halibut tour. That's like 350 That's right. <laughs> okay, going out.
pretty cool, huh? Yeah. That's a conical pot or a dome pot, we call it in the fishery. You guys are all good. Or what up? Yeah, sure. Yeah. You came running down, you want to hold one. You want to hold him? You'll never get to do this again, that's what I'm saying. Got your fingers over there. Four fingers down here and one right here. Yep. Got it? Oh, he's sharp. Yep. But it's not going to hurt you. Not those things are What's What size do I do, honey? <laughs> Yeah, there you, there you go. go. There you go. Yeah. My kids won't believe this ever. Yeah. You got it. Thank you. It's gonna pop out way up. We're pulling the picture. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Two old friends. <laughs> <laughs> now it's a commercial break. Thank you for coming to Travel Guide and Photography. I hope you're enjoying this video on the Aleutian Ballad for the Berry Sea Crab Fishing Tour. If you like what's going on here, I want to keep these going. Please subscribe. Hit the bell so you know when I post a new video. Thank you again, and let's get back to the show. Come on out here and get some pictures, people. Oh, okay, perfect. Yes, look out for each other. Awesome. Take each other's pictures. Trying to get a file for you. <laughs> <laughs> Take file. Okay, right. I'll sit I see smiles and laughing. Okay, remember what we're doing here, though, with the reef sorts. This, we, they kind of look real, don't they? You know what? They were actually made for real king crab. Well, if they were a live crab, they'd just be laying on the door. We were excited that we got to do this. This gave us the opportunity to set it up as if it were fishing on the ocean floor. All right, coming down. Every buoy in the ocean has a tag associated with it. And so they send us their tag. And we put them in the bow of the boat and back in the galley. Uh, and we asked our guests if you have somebody you wish could have made it here to fill that kettle. Maybe somebody that inspired you throughout your life, you know, write a memory now. Uh, and don't donate to things. If you don't have a dollar, don't worry about it. But, some people put a box, a couple bucks in the box, grab the tag, go to memory. These are from this morning. And uh, at the end of that first season, uh, we cut the web out of this pot. We rolled it up. It was that big round. And we went down to that tiny community in Oregon. The wives had rented a room. They sent out this message on Facebook. Hey, come to our, our get-together and let's brainstorm how to raise money. We showed up that day, there was nobody in the room, but the three ladies had started that memorial fund. We brought that web in the room and laid it out on the floor, and we got down from here to be, started to read the members, and the ones that brought high in that room, and then we gave them a $16,000 check for the memorial. Thank you, everyone. Yep. Spot's gone. Spot over. Strong pot here coming. There we go. 
thousand pots a day, you're getting some fish. You're making some money. Good eat right there. See, those pots are heavier on the bottom. They're bigger. That's how they sit the right side up. And those starfish, they like to eat the same thing. You get the whole side. You can put them back in the basket, like like this one. Here. You see him? Yeah. Oh, uh, this is more my type. Remember when you come out? Sometimes they'll wrap, they'll wrap right around the prawn. Oh, yeah. They'll just hug it, and then your stomach comes out, and they look right next to it. Wow. That's oh, it's beautiful. Do you want to touch it? Sure. Okay, I'll lay it on your hand, and I'm going to take a picture of it, okay? Okay. Isn't it beautiful? Well, they look good. It's full of crap. Now that's why I got reindeer on. All right, thanks, man. Come in. All right, well, it's my feet, too. All right, well. Oh! Everything I told you about the slime meal was true. Yeah, that is a giant Pacific octopus. He is our first. He's got nine frames. One for every leg and one for the mantle. Three hearts. And he's got a big ear. The deal is that most high is. When most high is out, up here in Alaska, they say the table is fat. Let's see you Yeah, it's one thing to see them over there, and it's one thing to see them still close to the boat. We'll get people that answer their travels. They've already taken the people to somewhere else. Then we take on the travel tour, and they see this. And then we hear about the eagle tour that they saw with two white golf balls in a tree 400 yards away. So, we are very, very fortunate. Once again, that's the eagle that's in Anybody not getting any fish? <laughs> <laughs> all right, look, look at all these crabs we got going on here, Larry. <laughs> this guy right here is a, is a Puget Sound king crab. I've been fishing for 50 years. This is the largest of the Puget Sound king crabs I've, all, I, I've ever caught. I've only caught three, two little ones, and this guy. Check out the claws on that. Look at the size of those claws. And the spikes on that. Wow. And the color. Uh, Who makes purple like this? Wow. It's like that color. Uh, 50 years of crab fishing. The police officer, I met the cat of the native village over that hill. He came by yesterday, picked up some king crab. I said, Roger, check it out. He said, I've lived here my whole life and I've never seen one of them. That's how rare that guy is. 
That's not like that. Is there a way to tell their age? That's not like that. Estimate age? There's no way to, that I know to tell the age, but I'm, I'm thinking he's 30 years old. And if you look at the big clock, he's got molar like teeth. Yeah. Okay? Wow. Just about guarantee that tooth or that claw would break your finger. Oh, yeah. If you let him get a hold of you. Wow. That is your Puget Sound King Trap, you guys. So he's Puget Sound King Crab. Came up on our book the other day. He tagged it. Pulled it right up. Look at the spikes on it. I mean, who, who makes that stuff? And the molars, as big as our teeth right there. Probably tough as our teeth. He'll crush clams and mussels. And the spikes on the back of his shoulder place to protect himself. That's something else, huh? It's incredible. Well, I hope you enjoyed the tour today. We're on the Aleutian Ballad on the Bering Sea Crab Fisherman Tour. As you watch the video, I'm sure you're thinking the same thing I am. This is one of the best tours out there. It's one of my favorite tours anywhere, but especially here in Alaska. Again, we are in Ketchikan on the Bering Sea Crab Fisherman's Tour. I hope you enjoyed Travel Guide and Photography. Please subscribe, hit the bell so you know when I posted another video. And this summer, we're really going to focus on Alaska, all the ports, all the tours, all the wildlife, everything I can think of covering for you. So again, please subscribe, and I wish you well.